This screencast will show you how to create an assignment submission area so your students can submit their work through Moodle. First, turn your editing on by clicking on the orange button in the top right hand corner. Next, find the section where you'd like to add the assignment and click on Add an Activity or Resource. A menu will pop up and Assignment will be the first option. Click on Assignment and Add. Next, we're going to add some details about our assignment. I'm going to give my assignment a name and I'm going to add some details that describe for the students what they need to do. It's up to you what you'd like to put in this description area. Scrolling down, the next thing we have to do is set our dates. If you have any questions about the options in Moodle, click on the question mark and a little help text will pop up explaining to you what it means. I'm going to allow submissions right away. The due date will be two weeks from now. And the cutoff date is when students can submit up until even if it's late. So I'll let students be able to submit one week late. The only ones that I'm going to change here are I would like my students to accept the submission statement so that they can verify their own work. And I have a lot of students in my class, so I don't want to be notified about each submission. I'll just check in when they're due. Now I have to decide how I want the students to submit their work. It will be through online text, so I'm going to change this to yes and they don't need to submit any files, so that will be no. I'd like to be able to write comments to them in Moodle, so I'm going to leave this to yes, and I don't have any files to upload for them to read for feedback, so I'll leave that with no. Grading will be out of 10, so I'll click on this and choose 10, and it's also going to be through simple direct grading, which is the default. You'll see here there's two other options, Marking Guide and Rubric. You can see the screencasts for those two options if you're interested. The rest of the settings I'm fine if I just leave them on default. So I'm going to click Save and Return to Course and see how it displays on our Moodle page. If I go into the assignment, I'll see all the information that I uploaded, the description, a grading summary, which tells me how many participants I have for the assignment, how many have submitted, and when the due date is.